Pinpoint Weather Report is sponsored by Anderson Plumbing, Heating and Air. Nobody wows clients like we do. I'm Moses Small in the ABC 10 News Pinpoint Weather Center. And if you're in San Diego and you step outside, really things might look like business as usual. Taking a live look, we see a beautiful view of downtown. We've seen a little bit of clearing of that marine layer, clear skies and fall brook. But for much of the country right now, all eyes are on the heat. We can see heat alerts stretching all the way from here to Texas. An estimated 30 million people facing those dangerous temperatures. And that includes some of us here at home. So right now we're desert community communities have an excessive heat warning that is going to stretch until tomorrow night at 9 p.m. And when you take a look at those current temperatures, you see exactly why that warning is still here. Borrego Springs right now 109 degrees, Ocotillo Wells 105 degrees. Even some parts of the mountains are heating up right now with Julian at 82, Warner Springs at 86. Thankfully, much milder along the coast right now, San Diego at 66 degrees. So thankfully that heat wave certainly not stretching to the coast. San Diego is going to stay in the lower 60s for most of the night. We're going to notice some cloud coverage, a bit of patchy fog creeping in for points of the evening. And for our inland neighborhoods, they're going to see a similar cool down that will bring them right near 60 degrees. They'll get a little cloudy. And when you look at what that marine layer is going to do, the main thing, uh, main thing the June gloom is going to do for us on the coast is going to shield us from a bit of that heat. Notice the way that the marine layer clouds swoop in for the night and even by tomorrow afternoon, looking all the way forward to 4 p.m. We're not entirely cleared out along the coast, so that is going to give us some partly cloudy skies, but it's also going to keep our highs looking beautiful tomorrow for San Diego, right? So for tomorrow, they're going to hit a high of 71. Chula Vista reaching up to 72 tomorrow. And of course, the desert staying extremely hot. Borrego Springs is going to hit 109. Some of our inland neighborhoods are hanging out in the 80s. Escondido 80 degrees on the dot. Santee tomorrow going to hit a high of 82. And tomorrow, Lemon Grove is looking at a high of 77 degrees. Now take a look at what happens with San Diego's seven day forecast. We are staying nice and stable. So take all those conditions tomorrow. Basically rinse and repeat all the way till the middle of next week. And then we see a little more sun peeking out for next Wednesday and Thursday for our inland neighborhoods. Highs are going to stay right near 80 degrees tomorrow topping out at 80 looking at upper 70s for many spots like Escondido for the days after that. And into the mountains, you're going to see a little bit of warming for early next week. Tuesday hitting a high of 81. Deserts are staying hot. Be very careful if you're around there because they have triple digits for the next seven days.